back at it again guys. Today we are taking a little look at the Canon M50 and <clears throat> why I'm actually recommending it to beginner vloggers or you just want to get them cleaner, crisper shots on your family holiday, take some cool little videos. This, this camera is for you. Righto, let's go over some of the specs of the Canon M50. It has a 24.1 megapixel camera, which is more than anyone ever needs. This is a great camera. Pair it with some good lenses and it is actually a boss camera. Shoots 10 frames a second. This thing is actually really fast. Once you put it on um, the high speed continuous shooting, um, it's really good getting kids photos because they're always running around, or even though they're playing sports. This is such a good camera for taking those photos. Really love it. It's an APS-C size sensor, which is a great sensor. A lot of Canon cameras use them, a lot of Sony cameras use those sort of sensors. But half of you don't even know what APS-C is. So I'm not gonna go over it. So let me just tell you, it's a good sensor. It is a really good sensor. So it shoots 4K video. Now, I've talked about it a couple of times guys, 4K isn't that important, 1080p is more than enough for what anyone ever needs, even if like for a beginner, 1080p is perfect, it's all you need, you don't need 4K, um, once you learn more about the craft, then I suggest you look at a camera like I'm shooting on the EOS R now, it shoots at 4K, it is a great camera, um, but yeah, it also has Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. Why would you need those sort of things? Well, there's a Canon app you can download and you can have a remote, you have your phone as a remote and use your camera from a distance. So it's literally a remote for your camera. So that is really good. So another feature, it's not really a feature, but I just like it. Look, I'm picking it up. It's, it's light, it's very light. So I'm running a, a Sigma 16 mil lens. Now this lens is really good, crisp, so it's such good photos paired with the Canon M50 using this lens. It's a good vlog style lens. Um, it's a very wide lens. Again, I'm not gonna get into, if you understand the terminology, um, good. If you don't, I suggest you learn. <laughs> All it's saying is that it gets a wide shot instead of a narrow shot. So the lower the number of your, which you wouldn't go any lower than a 16 millimeter. So when they say, so for instance, a GoPro, they're a wide lens. This is a wide lens, essentially GoPro on hand. It comes with a kit lens. Now I use this kit lens a fair bit. It wasn't too bad until you start to, it is a 15 to 45, which is a good size lens, um, good zoom, all that sort of business. Yeah, it was actually, it still is actually a really, really good uh, lens to use. I haven't picked it up in a while, to be honest, because I've got better lenses. Another good lens and another good f attachment or accessory to buy for the Canon M50 is this Canon EF lens adapter so these are EFM mounts for the camera so essentially just a small amount if you buy an adapter you can run all Canon's EF range of so I've got the nifty 50 here this is an actual boss of a lens I think every photographer or every videographer has a nifty 50 so I picked it up for 50 bucks so how much do you pay for a Canon M50, if you buy it brand new, obviously it's brand new. You get all the accessories, uh, if you get a few accessories with it, a charger, battery, a strap, and the kit lens, that's basically it. And you'll pay about eight, 900 bucks. Now, if you go on Marketplace or eBay, you can actually get these for like 400 bucks and hunt around, because they're out there, even Marketplace, all those sort of order secondhand dealers, you can really pick yourself up a really good camera. Another thing I like about the M50 is the articulating screen on the back here. So you can really see what you're doing. 
and it's a good clear screen. Now, I use it a lot. They are a little bit temperamental. Um, I guess I'm gonna say this, it's not a GoPro, and it damn right shouldn't be a GoPro, because it is actually really good. Now, if you, settings for this, guys, again, I'm just gonna say, if you're a beginner, and this is like the first time you've picked up a camera, and you're buying a good camera, and you're like, nah, dumb GoPros, and buying a good camera, just flick everything on auto. I, I just say that until you learn more about the craft of either taking a photo, um, taking a cool video, just flick everything on auto. It's gonna be, it's gonna save you a lot of time. You can literally just flick it on auto, put it on, boom, point, shoot, done. Like, can't stress that off. And lighting, a good light. This is just a, um, like a UF, Ulanzi. Oh, this is just a cheap eBay light, but it works good. I use it for my GoPro and it's got a little dimmer switch on the back. And you kind of hook that up on the hot shoe mount on top and you got yourself a good little light for the camera. Um, this shoots raw. Now, what raw is, it's essentially it just gathers more data of the photo to give you a cleaner, crisp image as well as shooting normal. So when you take a photo and you get your put the files on the computer, there'll be like a copy file next to it, that's your raw image. So it'll be have more information in that image than the other one. The raw is mainly for the guys who know how to use your photo editing apps, they'll want raw. So other than that, if you're not using raw, it will take good photos and it will go well on social media, Instagrams or whatever you choose to send wherever you choose to send or whoever you choose to send your photos to. So the Canon M50, rate it. Righto, again, I hope you guys are liking some of these videos that I'm making just to give you guys some beginner advice or wish things that I wish people told me when I was looking at this sort of stuff. Well, I'm kind of lucky I had someone to tell me those sort of things, so I didn't make too many bad mistakes in buying stuff. But again, if you find value from this sort of content or you want to see more of it, drop a comment, like the video, share it with the algorithm, subscribe to the channel. Righto, see you next week. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? <laughs> back in that, back in that bag again. Whoa, whoa, yeah, yeah. Back in there, yeah. Tell them to watch it. Nah, I ain't talking my pockets. Just know we ain't running out the way that we stock it. If I got it, you got it. If I call it, she slide and tell her to mop it. Yeah, I got that shit.